Hey everyone, let's take a look at number 15. It says scientists examined the activity level of fish at seven different temperatures. Fish activity was rated on a scale of zero to 100, so no activity to maximal activity. The temperature was measured in degrees Celsius and a mini tab printout is given below. Okay, so things that I see is I've got two numerical variables. I've got some scale that goes from zero to 100, and then I've got temperature that's measured in degrees Celsius. So I can see here I have two numerical variables. And whenever that happens, I'm going to be dealing with regression analysis. Or I should say whenever that happens in here, there's plenty of other situations where you don't deal necessarily with regression analysis, but we are here in this class. And the, the column that we always need is the coefficient column. And there's my explanatory variable. All right, so let's take a look at this. It says, what was the activity level rating for fish at, temperature, at a temperature of 20.4 degrees Celsius? So the first thing I wanna do is set up my LSRL. So what that means is I know from here, I can predict my activity rating, right? That's what I'm predicting with this linear regression equation. So I've got 148, 0.617 minus 3.21667 times the temperature. All right, so just let me color code this, matching this up, right? Here's always my y-intercept and my slope, taking note that my slope is negative. So y-intercept, slope, slope's negative, right? This variable here is always your explanatory variable. And then by default, the other variable has to be the one that's your response variable, the one you're predicting. So I've got all of that, but this is saying, hey, can you plug in 20.4? And let's, let's see what this is. So we've got activity rating. All right, I can predict that with 148.617 minus 3.21667 times 20.4. And I'm going to just see what that number is equal to. Let me clear all of this out. So we have 148.617 minus 3.21667 times 20.4, and we are getting about 82.997. All right, so let me go ahead and write that, 82.997. And it looks like we're doing these activity levels. We're going to round to the nearest whole number. So that's going to be 83, and there's my answer.